One of you guys, Jordan or Evan, either pick a random comment or scroll and do do the thing, and then we're going to do a coin flip. Their comment versus my comment. Here we go, guys. Yeah, you can pick. No. Okay, I got flower C. Always love your content. Should we just go flower C and what's below and then just flip those two? Yeah. It's probably easiest. Cause I was like right, you see see the thumb action, it was like right in the middle there. And then Bradley on the toasty line was a winter skew across Nike, but I think the supply chain shit Push them back. So Brad, Leon, and Flower C. To you two, heads and tails. We're gonna see who's taking home. How much, Berwin? Thirty-five. Damn, thirty-five. Nice Sheesh, I mean. Yeah. All right, let me screenshot this to make sure I got it. So heads, we're going to be Flower C. Tails, we're going to be Brad, Leon. Good luck. Thank you guys for the comments and watching all the videos and all that stuff. I shouldn't do it in here, should I? I would love you, hope you. <laughs> right? <laughs> you know, that's a new, you know. Here we go. Tails That was a good flip. Ooh, it is heads. Man. Flower C. Four days ago. Always love your content. You are the winner. We're going to pin this comment right now. Hit you up and hopefully send you 35 bucks. YouTube, what's up? Today is Tuesday. As you can see, over 40 orders going out. Shout out to everyone who hit us up via DM, via Instagram, via eBay, email, via Jordan, via Evan, via Berwin, via me, via Top Shelf Kicks, via anything to order all this stuff. I mean, the array of items here is just crazy. Let's just start up here. We got the playoff 12 size 14. This was a DM and a Venmo sale heading out to Cali. So shouts to you for supporting. We got a lightly used eight and a half. Here we got a Supreme Dunk. I don't know if I've told this story, but I've, I've lost a lot of money on those sometimes we make bad investments here we have an interesting one you probably will never see this is the red comfort high dunk red october i guess it's dubbed i've had this sneaker for over two years probably and it finally sold for 500 bucks so i'm happy about that obviously we got some classic spits like some mids some sakai's some reacts guys clown this shoe all you want but cardiac kimba used to get busy in these in college if you know you know he definitely did we got some resin 450s unc fours foam runners couple beaters slash not so beat shoes couple jerseys Jerseys. And that's about it. I'm out of breath, man. That's a lot of good stuff, guys. Anything for the people for all these great orders. I think this is my original hat when I used to wear seven and five eighths. But go, go on, go on. <laughs> that red October dunk, like you said, that, that shoe's been here in the back, literally. Like anytime I go back there, that ten and a half is just sitting there. Like happy to see that one go. Two Sakai's, those nasty joints. So, uh, uh, hold up, <laughs> Ferragamos, guys. Ferragamos, Salvatore. Need to beat the case fives. Hey, man. <laughs> Affordable fashion right here. This funny heat satin hat. Speaking of heat, you know what I'm gonna say, guys. Shouts to the Bucks. Shouts to Giannis Antetokounmpo, one of the goats. Mad people DM the account. I didn't answer the DMs, I'm gonna be honest, but they were like, Celtics and six. Celtics gonna kill the Bucks. Celtics, Celtics, you don't know what you're talking about? Hey man, I still don't know what I'm talking about. We'll see, we'll see, but big money on the Bucks. Anything else to start off the week, guys? Anything you wanna say to the people, anything? Bucks and six. Bucks and six. Still got the sun. I still believe. Oh, yeah. That's oh, it. That's all I got. That boy Luca was looking. Luca, ridiculous. I want to say shouts to everyone for all the support and all that stuff. We really appreciate it. We have a lot of work to do. Should be a good week. Not sure if we're going to go to the sneaker show this weekend just because it's really hard for us to close the store Saturday on you guys. But we're going to see what we can do. Let's take a picture of all this stuff and see what happens today. Here we got a trade from Ohio. Shouts to Ohio. His name is Ricky. He traded in a couple pairs for another pair. So we're going to see what he traded in real quick. Here's the quick note. This is the trade for the Jordan ones. I want to thank Jordan for working with me on this. I've been watching you guys for a little over a year now. I love the content you guys are very fair and know how to treat your customers i'm looking forward to being a repeat customer i know aaron is a bird fan so i threw a couple of sleeves of randall cunningham cart wow i appreciate it one of my favorite qbs growing up again i appreciate you guys ricky from ohio shout out to you ricky we're just gonna check out what you sent us over here we got a coconut milk air jordan one mid right here so it was you it was jordan so. i do remember it remember this now oh oh he quite a few sleeves and up uh, we got a damaged box there which isn't nice but you know it's cool guys we're not really too picky when it comes to that in this particular situation got this air jordan one low diamond i've been seeing a lot of people talking about these when it comes to a jordan one low that's going to go up in price and then we got all these cool eagles cards shouts to the eagles shouts to aj brown so shouts to ricky really appreciate it. thank you these are really cool and uh definitely going to put them somewhere i can look at all the time three on those okay and the other guys 170 ish mm. these are one as well yeah one one Okay, cool. Uh, let's see what we, we can do. I'm not sure what we had those up for, but obviously we can see. 
Yeah, okay. Thanks, bro. Yeah, no problem, man. You said you were looking for like 470-ish credit, right? Something yeah. in that ballpark? Okay, just a number. You go from there. Yeah, I got you. Let me just show you what I do. How'd you acquire the Oregon Force? Or do I not want to ask? No, you can. <laughs> I, I traded for them. I had a pair yeah. of uh, patchwork Dons, the LVs that were oh, you wow. and then back in the day. Yeah. yeah, so I traded those. They were pretty beat, and these are worn, so these came worn too. So yeah. I think we just did a straight swap. I don't remember if he added it or not. But. Damn, that's dope. So these I think might be a little tough for us just because like the shoe brand new doesn't really sell. Yeah. Well. They're obviously clean and in like a good condition. I don't know if you could do like 125. What was retail on them? Uh, 120 on goat, they're 229 new, brand new, yeah. Then the pulse, I mean, you tell me what you think, like the lowest. I hate saying that, but three might be a little high. You said 125 here, yeah. Can you do 380 total, was it 375? So 380, 380. doesn't sound terrible. Okay. And then I don't know if you can do like 650 on these, lowest used on goat, 630. So 650, and these just look really clean. What did I say, 380? Yeah, you know, so two, 270? 270. Yeah, that's cool. If that's fair, yeah, 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 definitely. Just double check everything's good, but they look really good. I was going to keep them there, it's a little too big. Man. They grew on me. I think they grew on all of us. I like, yeah, man. We were, sure. I was kind of like clowning them at first because like everyone's going crazy. I feel like you have to wear the heck out of it too to really appreciate it, and then you'll be like, I'm Damn. definitely going to wear that. Yeah, I could tell. I mean, you're wearing those. I feel <laughs> like you're going to wear these. So. Is it cool, bro? Yeah, they're fire. Yeah, I'm definitely going to keep coming here, man. Where is online or shopping here? Definitely. Yeah, hey, let me know when you get the 260. How you guys doing? Uh, yep. Just go. You got an bro. Word. Thanks, bro. Appreciate I'll you, man. Back, bro. Yes, sir. So you wanted the Hyper Royal 10 and a half new, and you wanted the Bread Easy, right? Uh, yeah. Ah, okay, cool. 10 and a half. You got one in one pair, right? The Bread Easy? Yeah. Yeah. So you put down 400, correct? Yeah. Okay, cool. I told you 850 for both. Um, let me get you the hyper roll. Yeah, this is the hyper roll. You want to put these two towards them? Or you want to pay cash and put these two towards something else? No, no. All right, cool. Let me add something else. Uh, I could just take it off these two, honestly. You might, you might owe you. Uh, what else do you owe for? Um, Give you back a hundred. You got more stuff? Uh, yeah. So this stuff. So there's a there's a, like a vintage polo T-shirt that I got that I saw on your uh, eBay. Uh -huh. I'm wondering if you could trade that stuff in for it's like a polo, like a yellow T-shirt kind of right here. So what's up? This stuff? Yeah, that stuff right here. I want to be interested. It's like sitting on my closet. I've never worn those and. Some of these two, three, two hats are like brand new. What would you want for these? I don't know. You tell me. I, I, I think it's like what, 200, 200 credit for them. You want to trade these? Yeah. Oh, did you see anything you want to trade for? Like I know you said this is separate. Um, did you see anything you want to trade these for towards? Uh, I see that another sneaker back there. So this might be for like a. I think I saw um, maybe pine greens that you have 2.0. The pine green 2.0s. What size? A eight use, yeah. I, I hit on them, and a half, that's why. Like, what you want for these? What, like 80 bucks? Can't think of them. Brand new for like 160. Can you do 70? Yeah, that's fine. Man. All right, that is cool. So you could take this one, all right. Um, oh, you 70 here, yeah. And then the pole t shirt is yours. Good man, I yes, appreciate sir. it, man. Yes, sir. Have a great right, man. It, is. it just runs long, but this is that's, that's fine. My shoulders are, you know what I mean? Let me see. We got this one right there. Yo, can I see these though? I ain't never like see them just in like person. Oh, the majority of them? Yeah. I ain't know, let me see. Fire. You like those? Nah, I like. I just like seeing shit I ain't never seen before. Like, you know what I mean, I don't got a fit for them, bro. But this one's thirty. Thirty? Yeah. Thirty? Yeah. Oh, I bet. <laughs> you don't fuck with these? Hell no. <laughs> Hell. <laughs> they all right. You know what I mean? They, they ain't too bad. Can't. Can't jack these. Can't jack these. What's these? These fires? Uh. What else for y'all? Nah, nah. Someone. <laughs> someone, 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 <laughs> someone was interested in them. Uh, Let me see. What? Janet, yeah, what's on the back? What's on the back? Not on the back. What's, what about that one? That's fire too. Oh. Uh, you, uh, Apple Pay, right? Yeah. Uh, so all together, how much is it? Uh, 130. Oh boy. 
you're looking for? Yeah, not for me. Because my boys, he does like storage units and shit, but in junk removal. Uh -huh. And he said that the owner didn't want these, so he's, he'll literally take whatever for it. I went to the other shops, but they wasn't talking the right price. So. What were they offer you over there? It was like 120 I know they're pretty beat, but for right one, so. Uh, these are no good. No? What does that mean? Look at the stitching. These lines right here? Yeah. What does that mean though? This means they're no good. They're not supposed to be there. I can show you again too. Who else? But what does that mean exactly? Basically, what they do is like in fake factories, what they do is they dot lines basically to mark where they want to line the shoe up. Oh. But the shoe, a real Nike shoe, like for example, like a Hyper Row, you just see how everything's just even, nothing like it's coming Ooh, up. Okay. On here. So these are fake, you're saying? These are fake. Uh -huh. I don't like to use the word fake. I just like to say no good because when people hear fake, they like, oh, just yeah, no man. good. But like when I put it, when I went back there, turn off the light, more stuff came up here. Like it's kind of hard to see, but like you see right there. Oh, shit, yeah. Damn. There, and just look at the, when you flash on the, the jump in, it's green. Damn, so what should, like, what do you recommend he do that he does with them? I mean, if you got it from a storage unit, then it's like, I don't know how Yeah, they were pay. free. They were free. You know what I'm They're free. Then but, I'm, like, is there a market for stuff like that? I, I truly don't know, honestly. Right. You know, there's people out there who may buy them just for the bottoms or, like, who wants to do a project or something. Right. Um, oh, that's cool. Thanks for showing me that, though. Yeah, no problem. What's bro. this going on with those? That should look that's just glitter. Oh, glitter? It's perfect. Yeah, this is just glitter. It's just over time when you leave in the box, royal shadows, shadow backboards. Mm. And then, again, just look at the color. I know these are warm, but just look at the difference in color. Right, and that, yeah. Oh, you know? shit. I figured they were, like, he was asking me, I figured there was a height because the, the quality and leather. Bro. And then look at the, you see how the R is reaching to the D? Mm -hmm. Then look at here. Just look at the R. Oh, yeah, this is thicker, too. Mm -hmm. Damn, that's crazy. What are you looking for for this? Are you trying to sell or just or sell or trade? Just sell all this. Just sell? Alright. Did you have proper amount for this stuff? Nah, not really. Man. Okay. Those, are, those are girl kicks. You rarely see those. Yeah, you said you had no price in mind for all this stuff, right? No, not really. Uh, you want you want a total price for everything, or you want it individually? I guess we could do both. Can we do both? Oh uh, yeah, we go one by one. I guess we start off here with the five rings. All right. How much were you looking for for those? I don't know, man. What you thinking? Uh, I'm looking at two thirty for those. I was thinking like two for the fours, and then fifties. I'm looking at two twenty. So I was thinking six fifty for those three. Um, these two, what are you thinking? I get like a buck fifty for both of those. I'd be fine with that. Together or, yeah, or separately? Together. Together. together right. Cause I might just take the fours, that's it, and take them out and just leave the rest with you. So you wanna take the fours out, you said? Yeah. What were you want for the fours? Yeah, it's gonna pay like three fifty for those. So like I don't mind taking an L but that's a big L. The prices on the fours is, is like really, really weird. Like yeah. I'm seeing sales of two nineteen, two twenty, then you gotta jump up to three, then back down to yeah. two thirty. So it's like it's really, really weird. So let's take the fours out for now. We're at four fifty if we took out the fours. Mm -hmm. You said 150 for both. I'll be at 125 for both, just because these are a little bit lower. Both of them a little bit low, but I'll probably be like just 25 dollars off, which would make it 575. Is what I was at for. Now you can't go six. You want to flip a coin? 575 six. I do 575 six. Six fifteen. Nah. 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 75. Uh huh. 570. 610. Nah, you went back five and went up 10. Alright, so I go to the. 575, 6. That's, that's what we said. You at, your, you at 6, I'm at 575. You wanna do that? You do it. I'm gonna use a half dollar, but. Alright, you can do that. You can do that, that's fine. Tails, right? Oh, alright, you got tails. Yeah, yeah, right now. That's. That's a double sided coin right there? Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. Alright. Uh, what's the best way for you? I take cash, man. It opens on Sundays too? Um, nah, Sundays and Mondays will close. It's been a weird day. Not a lot of buying, honestly. But shout out to that dude. Sold some good stuff. Sold some Kobe's. Some Kobe. Damn. Do you see what's the trend here? Hmm. What's the trend here? I just caught the trend. Two Kobe's, two fives? Yes, but something else. They're all my size. 
<laughs> Something else. Yeah, I kind of want to guess. <laughs> want me to say it? Oh, no, 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 no. Old and new? Want me to say oh, it? Oh, MJ and Kobe? Nope. All right, 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 right. They're all fives. Oh! <laughs> I just caught. I was, I was about to Damn. say. I was about to say. I was about, I was about to say. Like, I got Kobe fives and Jordan fives. That's a wait. It's a five. I don't party. know shit about Kobe's. <laughs> <laughs> but shout out to that dude. We did a little coin flip. One. I'm not gonna lie. I was a little nervous inside. I was looking a little frail. I was like, damn. Am I about to lose this twenty five dollars? Like, usually it's tails never fails, but you know, it's bad juju when you call it before it's in the air. You know, victory to the home team. We take those. I'll take those. <laughs> You wanna start off here? I feel like this was an outlet sneaker. Just look at the box, bro. Like, just no lid on the box. That stock. This is a GS eight and a half. Literally a regular eight and a half. Thing they call the hairs, something like that. Got those. We got the Olympic fives. Fun fact about these. Back in the day, man, you had yourself a pair of these. Mm. You was somebody. Twenty three on the side. I know Burns. I no, need. No, no, no. Burns. I don't know. <laughs> Off camera, Burns like he's gonna put the cream laces in here to match oh, the no. cage. <laughs> Hey, yo, the Yankee hat? Yo, that could go with the fit we were talking about earlier. <laughs> be looking alpha burn right now. Not one, but two Kobe mm. fives. I'm kind of upset how they keep releasing Kobe fives because to me, Kobe fives wasn't even his best sneaker. I need to see some Kobe sevens. Ooh. Some Kobe sevens, yo. They, they releasing like, Ooh. they released like, <laughs> you know, they brought the Grinches back. They brought the All Stars, the Del Souls, and all that. But like, can I get some Kobe sevens? No, you right. We got the GGs that just released. I fell asleep. I was, I woke up 30 minutes too late. I would have just resold them, honestly, as bad as that sounds. No, they gonna feel high. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I am happy Nick hit on those because he did want those. He did want and he's those. He's a Kobe guy. He's a Kobe guy, and he was able to obtain for retail so nick if you're watching this or when you do watch this happy for you small w's man they, they add up his nike account is crazy he, he tried to be modest but his nike account is crazy <laughs> bro like he hits every sneaker let's come over here real fast shout out to will uh we met will at a sneaker show in delaware he's one of you guys he's a youtube supporter he's been dm us for like you know quite some time now i forgot what he traded in for these but it was it was, a, it was a lightning eight and a half the used one right yeah so he traded in a lightning for eight and a half used for a brand and new size six and a half shout out to you well we really appreciate it we're gonna get this packed up we're gonna ship it out tomorrow because the post lady already arrived probably the worst easy in here i like this shoe but this shoe just doesn't do well there was a lot of hype pre-release like way 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 back nba all-star weekend in chicago people was taking mm. off their ones and their off whites for these like yo i remember that weekend because kanye got in his like little truck and wasn't mm -hmm. he just throwing them shits out the back i think Quavo was with him too. yeah and that's when they had the joke yeah the, the, um, be hard 992 yeah oh damn you're right wow and then, remember they had these it was supposed to be chicago exclusive yeah and they had the um the shot on the, the, the back yeah they released to everyone and everyone who got those was sick <sighs> what a time what a time <laughs> we got some barclays right here so this is going out to minnesota these are type dogs i'm not gonna lie like i feel disgusting just holding these but shout out to you for purchasing these honestly and then shout out to the mingle he copped a bunch of shorts a baseball jersey and a t-shirt i got a let me see what t-shirt did he cop again regular 23 air jordan t-shirt this baseball jersey that we had for a while now damn is this a sign it's on the back oh curry chef curry chef curry oh is he gonna cook tonight i don't know that's damn that's a sign i think you were eyeing these at one point right I th uh yeah because they didn't so. come these come with the magic, magic yeah right? size medium champion shorts you don't really see champion nba stuff that often but these are really really fire honestly this one probably my favorite item going out size 38 new orleans hornets basketball shorts damn they were in new orleans at one point it's a lot to grasp but like damn i never knew that the charlotte hornets was the charlotte no whoa, whoa, whoa. The charlotte hornets became the charlotte bobcats back to the charlotte hornets oh wow new orleans made a team they were the new orleans hornets when charlotte was the bobcats then they changed to the pelicans the bobcats went back to the hornets it's a lot it's, a, it's, it's so confusing it's, so, it's, it's a lot like i know your brain is like, <laughs> like adding everything and all that but it, it is a lot going on but um i think he's looking for it so when hurricane katrina happened they stayed in oklahoma city so there's um this new orleans what that says oklahoma city hornets or something like that the oh, new war when they stood when they stayed in oklahoma city that's wild just little that's rare probably huh 
Wow. Only reason why I knew that is because I get it from A. Whenever A starts, to, you know, dropping the knowledge and stuff like that. Yeah, so we're gonna back this stuff up. Took a lot of pictures today. Got a couple more pictures to take pictures of. But a lot of stuff is up. 4,000 listings. Shop on eBay, guys. Call us. DM the store page. Yeah, whatever you guys see, call us. Let us know what you guys are interested in. DMs is hard to get by. So, again, recommend you guys calling us. We don't pick up the phone. It just means the phone's dead, honestly. Only time we don't ever pick up the phone or we're just on another line with someone else. Other than that, 556. So we're probably gonna wrap up soon. Bro, are you putting that bell on the line today? You said I'ma hold it till Tuesday. Yeah, right, we could we could put it on the line. I got a lineup. I actually thought I got on the way here today. What's the, what's the lineup? What's the lineup? Me, you, a Evan. Ah! <laughs> See this? This is, what, this is what I mean, bro. We, we, we here. We here. Gotta get A out of here. <laughs> you know? You don't like the pressure, right? No. <laughs> 628, winding down. Um, got everything that we needed. Pictures of. Got everything that needed to go out today. To go out. Boxed up and all that good stuff. Um, shout out to everyone who came to the store and pulled up and bought some stuff. Sold some stuff. Traded some stuff. All that good stuff. Game two tonight. Boston versus Milwaukee. You already know who A has. He's doubling down on his bet with Giannis. I got a question. Who's better? Miami LeBron? LeBron or this Giannis? Let us know in comment. I just want to see Miami LeBron dogs Giannis. That's just me. A says otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> you know he's 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 a he's he's the number one fan club supporter right there. I just never seen someone support Giannis more than A. I'm not gonna lie, like that's the number one fan right there. But yeah, catch you guys tomorrow. One and done. Bye. E money. What's done today? <laughs> whoa, whoa, move over. Why are you so far? To your left. Yeah, move, yeah. There you go. Why not? Oh. oh! I'm sending you over right now. Let me look at him fly and I'll show you where. I'm sending, if you look at your Instagram, I'm sending you some stuff right now to look at so you can see who we are. We have a store right across the street where we do our convention. Oh, awesome. And, That's uh, dope. And we would like to see if you'd like to come out. Our convention, June 4th, we'd like to fly you out. Damn, that sounds dope. I'm not really sure exactly. You said it's June 4th? June 4th, which is a Saturday. So we'll fly you out Friday and you come to our convention. But the problem is that, bro, is that they're flying out of New Jersey. And there's going to be cutting it too close. We're going to fly out on Friday. So we have to fly you on Friday and you can fly out Saturday or you can fly out Sunday morning, whichever you wish for you. We're avid watchers of YouTube too. Watch it here. Uh, our stores, we have two stores in Florida and we play here videos and loop. Damn, that's that's fire, man. I really appreciate it. I don't know, man. I guess I'd, I'd have to look into it. I really appreciate the offer. I, I got to look into it and, and try to, like, you know, make arrangements and shit like that. Oh, hey, whatever. Like I said, if you want to come out by sneakers, we also help you, you know, we'll give you a booth. You know, we'll, we'll, we'll Do you guys have like a, a, a hotel block or something like that for the show at all? Yeah, we cover your hotels and, and your flights, right? So all expenses for the trip? Yeah, we cover, we cover your flight, hotels, and meals the day of the show. And then also, like, we will pick you up, like, we'll pick you up at the airport, bring you to the hotel, we'll take care of that for you. And then whatever shoes you buy, normally what we do, like, you inventory them, we box them up. Our store is literally right across the street from the, uh, from the conventions. Wow, well, that's so fire. Now it would only be comp for one person? Uh, I think it's you and your cameraman, right? So, yeah, yeah I mean. Your cameraman. So, it, so there's a possibility of two people? Yeah, there is, there is two people. We, we, we budget all our influence to two people because we know, we know you guys fly, fly out with your cameraman and stuff like that. Plus, you know you have a part in your store. Yeah, wow, man. That's awesome. I definitely appreciate you reaching out. It, it sounds like something that we might be interested in. I just kind of have to figure out the uh, the date. The logistics yeah, the logistics and arrangements and stuff like that. But, uh... Right now, the best advice I give you is the Florida right now, inventory is, is freaking through the roof. I mean, either way, like, regardless of the inventory, it would be cool to, to make the content and go to Florida and, and uh... Exactly. The weather's beautiful out here, man. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, for sure. Okay, so so again, I have the info, and if anything, I could DM you, or can you want to leave me your number just in case I can get. No, this, this is my number. This is my number right here. So how do you find us? Just on YouTube or something like that? Oh yeah, you know, I watch you guys on YouTube, man. I watch everybody on YouTube, man. I watch everybody's shows because you know me. I, I'm a, I'm an older cat. I'm 37, you know, and I watch everybody, and I look the way you guys, you know, do business, the way you guys buy, and I implement my own system, you know. Yeah. I learn from everybody. And 100, that's what you gotta do. Learn from everybody. Yeah, that's what you gotta do. Learn from everybody. 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 Learn from like right at 12 so it definitely sounds like something i'll be interested in again i just have to work out the logistics and stuff like that for the date to <laughs> to make sure i get your air first and all that stuff in order we have a show we got meals for you we got catered food all that stuff and, and, yeah. come and enjoy it you know, enjoy it enjoy the beautiful weather here in florida you sound like a smart businessman, man. This would be a, this would be great for your brand, I think. You know, a lot of a lot of shows reach out to us, but but they never want to offer us much. The reason I'm taking over the sneaker convention game in Florida is because I actually fly out the buyers. Like I, I actually bring the buyers to my show. I pay for a flight to hotel. You know, I got four or five buyers that come out, and you know, they all spend you know forty, fifty thousand dollars. You got five, six, seven buyers. 
thousand dollars that they're buying from the vendors alone, and I buy two in the general public. But then every, but then every video, every fifty thousand plus video they put out with, with with your name on it, you know, you're smart. You know, that's how it's supposed to be done. A lot of people don't yeah. see it that way. You know how it is, man. These younger guys are just greedy. They want to make money, but don't want to invest money. A hundred percent. Yeah, they 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 want to give us a table, but have us drive eight hours. You know what I mean? It's like. <laughs> we'll fly you. We'll fly. We'll pay you for airfare, pay you for a hotel. We're, we're, we're bringing you here, we're picking you up, we're making sure you eat the day of the show, we're taking, we're, we take care of all our guys. That's why they all they don't fuck with us, because they see the way we are, they're like, yo, you dead. Like, even Brandon McCom, don't grow, you're different. No wonder you're, you're blowing up so hard. The steady grind, steady grind. No, 100%, man. That's dope. I'm, I'm... And, and, and making a relationship like this, making a relationship, reaching out to other people, and just basically building as a community. That's the problem with this, with this, with this, with this business. That everybody wants, everybody wants, 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 but nobody wants to give, give, give. That's true, <laughs> man. 100%, man. I really appreciate it. It means a lot. Thank you. No, you're good. So, yeah, I sent you some stuff for your DMs. You can see our recap, our, our flyer. I'd love to have you guys out. Um, let me know as soon as possible, so that way I get the tickets, and then I'll send you guys ticket confirmation, room confirmations, the day of the show, the day you guys come in, I'll pick you up personally at the airport, bring you to the hotel, and, you know, we, we kill it. That's awesome, man. I'll definitely get back to you either way. I mean, most likely we're going to try our best to go, but if not, we'll definitely get back to you regardless. So I definitely appreciate you reaching out. We'll be in touch. All right, well, thanks for taking my time. No Take problem, man. Time. Appreciate it, man. Have a good one. Might be going to Orlando, guys. I don't know. <laughs> Happy Wednesday. As you can see, we got a decent amount of orders. I forgot to mention though, yesterday, what was the count? I think it was 45. I counted. So it was 45 orders. I didn't talk about that yesterday, but uh, that's what's going to go to the lucky winner of today's episode. 45 smackaroos to do whatever you want. Oh, and also shout out to Vampire OG. Two giveaways ago he won and he donated it because he's from out of the country. So Enzo, I know you're watching this. Pull up. Uh, I think you have how much? 30? He called yesterday. Oh, he called about it? No, no. Enzo called yesterday and he said he, said he wanted that New York mix that in the back he's coming tomorrow okay Check it out. perfect so yeah he donated the money to someone else a random other comment because he said he has no zell or anything like that that we could send him out of the country so shout out to him because that's what's up anyways let's look real quick at these orders what jumps out at me these flints just because that 3m the way you look at it kind of reflects a little bit obviously this pair right here brand new size 11 and a half just something you'll never see i did want to hold on to them but i feel like this is something that nike will remake again and again got some kobe some all-star sixes space jam nines washed orange 700s this new york Jets jacket. You know, there might be some New York Jets hype coming up now. You know, Sauce. What's his name? Sauce Gardner. Sauce Gardner, if you're watching, pull up. We got some sauce for you, for real. Pause. Is that time for pause? Yeah. It is, it is Jordan? <laughs> Jordan's the pause expert, in case you guys are wondering. So I have to check in with Jordan. <laughs> I've been letting Elijah slide lately, but that one, that one just sounded a little crazy. Whatever. <laughs> Shout out to Sauce. Shout out to the Bucks, man. You guys weren't looking too good last night. I was talking my stuff last yesterday, and now I'm feeling a little, you know, a little, mm, I'm, a, I'm a little shaky. But I'm doubling down. It's all right. You know, two games at home, Milwaukee. Forget about it. Other than all these orders getting shipped out, we got a crazy phone call this morning from someone in Florida who wants to fly us out to a sneaker event. It was hotel rooms, uh, food, all that good stuff. It's pretty crazy to think that someone would want to uh, call up and, and fly us out to these shows. But at the same time, it makes sense because we have a lot of sneaker shows in our DM trying to get us to go to this show and that show show and hey can you drive five hours here and hey we'll give you a table or we'll give you a discount stuff like that at the end of the day i feel like a lot of these shows are hitting us up because they want us to make content at their shows to promote their brands and promote how cool their show is right like how many people show up and how many shoes are getting sold and bought and stuff like that obviously what is fifty thousand plus views worth it gotta be worth something it's really gratifying to see or hear someone feeling that the expenses are worth it to fly us out somewhere to do what we love buy sneakers talk about the culture stuff like that it's funny that we just got that call because literally this morning I was talking about how I felt like we were going to take a little bit of a break from these shows because I feel like there's a show every other day or every other month or every other week and there's someone new in our DMs every other week with a new show and a new opportunity for us to cash out and get a lot of inventory. One thing um, a lot of these promoters should know about us in particular is like we don't really need to go to these sneaker shows. We love going and we find inventory but when we're open on a Saturday here it's pretty booming. We have a lot of inventory coming in, a lot of inventory going out. So to close on a Saturday and go to a show it has to really you know be worthwhile we have a lot of inventory we have too much inventory so constantly going to these shows and cashing out for content is really cool but at the end of the day it's not something we need to do thankfully so with that being said not that we are you know the top dogs on the map or anything like that but you know we do provide a large amount of content and we can work with a lot of these promoters and events to increase their ticket sales and increase their presence in the sneaker culture right we are really here and we, we make a lot of content we do a lot of sales we have a lot of customers and clients etc so anyone who reaches out to us a 
event wise and you guys want us to promote your event and, and pull up to the event and make content and you know make two crazy videos videos that possibly get over a hundred thousand views talk to us about you know expenses and stuff like that again it's tough to close a store go places you know i pay these guys like we all get paid it's not like just a uh, hey let's just stop what we're doing and go to this sneaker show and promote their show because they're giving us a table with two chairs again i don't really know analytically what fifty thousand a hundred thousand views is worth i would assume it's worth you know more than two chairs and a table jordan what do you think well, i was sold or about like i guess both since we're on this topic just like what they both said what is 50k views worth to someone you know what i'm saying when you talk about us in our case like we're from jersey everything we do is jersey like if you look if you've ever been to the store look at the logos you look at the the t-shirts and everything that we put out it's jersey you know we rep jersey to the fullest we love jersey with that we got a lot of shows with people from jersey who was asking us to go to these shows and pull up to the show it's the biggest event in jersey everyone's saying that you know the price has got to be right like a said like we're closing down on saturday that's time for people from like pa we get people from virginia we get people from everywhere you know people take the time to travel like a few hours to come and like meet us and want to spend bread here with us so that means a lot to us so for us to close it down it just gotta make sense you know when you approach us about a show just come correct please because again it's four of us it's not easy doing what we do you know people think we just go to sneaker shows and we just drop bread and we go home it's a lot of work you know burns carrying a camera literally for eight hours like he don't do this in store literally carrying a camera all day his arms are tired his legs are tired evan and i are alternating from watching the table sometimes by ourselves because we don't have enough people we're buying like 80 sneakers that we gotta bring all the way to the car and back and forth and then we gotta come back to the shop it's like it's a lot of work if we're putting out two videos i feel like you know two videos plus 50k per video minimum is worth more than just a table i just feel like if you're gonna be a businessman stand on that you know try to promote yourself the best way possible if i'm a businessman and i want to go to a sneaker store and i want them to help promote my business i'm gonna be like yo what is it gonna take for you to come to my show help promote my business like you want what you want a hotel you want what like what's the like what's the price and it's just kind of crazy how timing works because we were just talking about it yesterday how we want to take a break and i told you hey i was like yo someone out there outside the state is going to hit you up and be like yo i want to fly you out like i love what you're doing and sure enough like this morning like first thing this morning that's what happened it's just you know an honor and blessing to be in this position because we all work hard here you guys don't see evan a lot little do you know the the sneakers you're looking for the stuff that's in the inventory the way the reason why we can easily find a sneaker evan that's why evan's not on camera you know he's doing the dirty work a lot of times oh this sneaker look cleaner than usual we wipe the sneakers down too like there's a lot that we do that you guys just don't see on camera so like we work hard here so like for us to close down again on a saturday just to pull up a sh to a show just because of free table when you really think about it, it's kind of not worth it anymore that's about that i don't want to keep going too much into it cause i could go about it all day and it kind of like aggravates me sometimes just looking at the sales right here so we're variety you see a couple sevens a couple sixes and a nine that shoe in there or my favorite item in there space jam nine just a beautiful sneaker the sneaker i was just talking to burwin about yesterday the kobe eight a jet jacket is that the most appealing stuff depending on who you're talking to but again it's, it's a good variety and i just want to mention that cb real fast because yeah, i was on my brother's instagram yesterday and my brother don't post a lot of pictures and like i clicked on his picture and as a kid i didn't notice but he had those as a kid which was pretty fire to see and you know to see it sell the next day was pretty dope so yeah a lot of good stuff we're gonna pack this stuff up get it out today yeah that's about it what was retail on this guy so you want more than 250? Nah, I'll, I'll get retail to be honest. Is that, like I don't know what it's going for at all. So yeah. it's a cool jacket though. And the sneakers, anything in mind? I was wondering if you made like three for each. Three each? Okay, bet I'll check. And you're just looking for cash, bro? Yeah. Gotcha. Are you negotiable on this one at all? Uh, what will, what will be offered? I can check it out. It's brand new in the yeah. package. I haven't opened it. I think three on these would probably be a little much for us. I'd probably like to be at uh, like two. F what was retail? Which one is that one? Static. I think two thirty. Yeah, I'd probably be like two forty. You said three on these as well, right? Yeah. So these seem to be going for about three. So I don't know if you want to like negotiate or hold on to them. Probably do like two sixty. Uh, um, if that's valid. Uh, could you do two fifty on these? Um, are you cool with 260 here? Yeah, I'll do the 260. Then I'm, I'm cool with the 250 on these, that's valid. Uh, now, this one is the tough one, man, because you're saying retail is 250. I think so. I think it was a little bit outside. But, like, you tell me, like, what you think, because I don't know if I could pay retail. I mean, this is just at the house setting, to be honest. So, like, what, what could you do, you do on that? I feel like if I took it, I'd pay 150. 150? Yeah, I don't know if that's worth it. Do too? Honestly, it feels like another color, maybe. It's yeah. just white stuff worries me because it gets messed up so quick. Like, if I don't move it, and then it's like, if I do move it, 
someone opens a bag and it's like, oh, there's a mark on it, or oh. even sometimes selling on StockX, it's like, there's like little marks. I'd probably be at that only for that right now. Um, but these two, we were at 510, and then if you wanted to do that, it would be 660, or we could just do 510 here. Oh, yeah, I'll take it. You want to do that? Yeah, okay, cool. Let me just check out the shoes, and then we'll go from there. Do you have a consignment where you sell them and give a percentage, or how's that work? Mm -mm, just buy them straight out. Um, all right, I mean, let me know. We had no price in mind. Oh, uh, I mean, I looked them up online, and some of the prices look astronomical, but uh, I think these are never worn. Some of them might have been worn once or twice. And no price in mind that you would want for like all or each? Uh, I mean, talk to me. We'll see what we can make work. How much were you looking for? Uh, like five. Yeah, five is going to be kind of tough. Stuff like this, they don't really go for much. This is probably like the best one out yeah. of the, uh, the six. Um, usually when we get stuff like this, it sells for like a hundred. So if you have time, I'll say try putting them up on eBay. Lift them for like whatever number you're looking for and just like listen to offers. I'll say try that. If you're trying to get like around the five, even like the fours or five range, I'll say try that. How about uh, this four cat? Can we meet in the middle at 350? Nah, I'm not four, man. Yeah, four. These ones are supposed to be stupid expensive, but I don't know if that's just some bullshit on whatever that is, you know? The best I can do on this stuff is 350. I think these two are the best ones. These four is going to just sell low for us. I, I just know already. 375. Come on. <laughs> Hit you with that review right now. Want to flip a coin? 350, 375. Damn, yo, you're like fucking Pawn Stars and shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck it. <laughs> you could flip it, but I'm calling head. Hey, you got it. You got head, you said? Yeah. All right. Ooh. Who we got? Tails. Oh. All right. <laughs> the coin rules. <laughs> uh, what's the best way for you? Uh, dollar bills. You don't have Zelle or anything like that? Yeah, I guess. Can we Zelle you? Just yeah, we don't yeah, have yeah. Cash. That's good. How much were you looking for for this stuff? Uh, I don't have prices in mind. Were you trying to sell or trade them? Uh, either one, honestly. That's a red box, obviously. Seven and a half. So these two, I'll just hold off just because the sizing and the shoe is just a little bit tougher to move mm -hmm. and the condition at the end. That's why I may be interested, depending on the price. We just backed up with a bunch of these, but obviously we'll be able to do it. Yeah, no price in mind. You want for the uh, top threes? Um, I mean, I was thinking probably like 150. Um, if we took these, probably like 120 for them. How much store credit? Uh, store credit, I'm bumping up to like 140. So you just look around, see if you find anything. Alright, uh, yeah, that's cool. I'll look around. Yeah, no problem. I keep it up here, right? Oh, yeah, you're cool, bro. These yeah. drones are supposed to be coming out on sneakers. What's that? These are re restocking on sneakers. Again? Yeah, right? Jeez. What is it, tomorrow? Yeah, I think so. Oh, damn. I can't keep track of all these dunks. Um, I mean, what's your best price on this? What was your offer? Oh, you probably won't be thinking the same number, honestly. I want to hear your number. What's your number? I'm not gonna kill you. What's your number? I was at like 240. Where are you at? 230. So I'm less. You gave me a better one. All yeah, right, that's, that's what I'm saying. I'm not, I'm so, I'm not gonna kill you. That's solid. That's solid. Yeah. I ain't even gonna argue with it. Um, so you owe 90. Yeah. Cool. Let me hold on. Let me make sure it's math for you. Yeah, we said. <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty sure it is. <laughs> 140 credit plus the 90 would be 230. Yeah, it's solid. All right, but cool. And would you like a bag? Uh, yeah. I got you. He got me on camera not knowing how to count. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, I was gonna say, you gotta pull a calculator. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, it happens to be on time. Nah, when you're trying to count like for a buyout, you're just sitting there, and sometimes you have like all 20s, that's the worst. Like, it happened the other day, like we had someone, um, <laughs> he came, he bought, he bought Travis Lowe's, and like literally all 20s. I'm just like, damn. So using that situation, I just count the 20s, and I just multiply it. Y'all got so a money easier. counter? Bruh. Well, we do a lot of Zelle, PayPal, Venmo, yeah, stuff yeah. like that. I feel you. Dude, if I hit on sneakers on these, I'm gonna be so upset. <laughs> you all good, bro. Damn, bro, y'all could have took these from me. <laughs> so Honestly, bro, real talk. We just rented, me and my wife just renovated our garage. I made her get rid of some stuff. She made me get rid of some stuff. <laughs> so I said, well, in my head, I'm like, I may be able to get something from mine. Your shit going in the garbage. My aqua is what you thinking for something like these. I have no idea. Okay. I, nothing for the jerseys either. I didn't have anything set in mind. I literally just grabbed the stuff mm -hmm. and y'all were the first ones that popped in my head. You got the patent breads, right? Back in the Yes, day. yes, yes, okay. correct. Yes. Okay. Yes, sir. For my daughter. Yeah. For her birthday. Yeah. For her, that was for her birthday. She turned 21. That's some good stuff. That's for sure. I, bro, I, I, I 
I'm almost annoyed and embarrassed that I forgot this stuff was in there. <laughs> it happens, man. Once you collect certain things, you know, some stuff just falls yeah. to the bottom. And of the I was like, oh, she was like, oh, I'm going to keep this, I'm going to keep that. I'm like, if you haven't looked for it or wore it in the last year or so, then why keep it? Yeah, yeah. She reversed me. <laughs> <laughs> stuff at all? No, nah, like I was telling your boys, I really came, I was, my wife and I were renovating our garage and I came across a lot of this stuff and I was like, let me just take it and see what's what. Oh, um, and you're just looking for cash for everything? Yeah, please, if you have. Alright, cool. Honestly, those jerseys from back in the day when we wore our clothes a little bit bigger. I still wear my clothes big. <laughs> you a big dude. So. <laughs> but yeah, you're right. Every, everyone wore stuff big back then. Yeah, like I was never a 54. I'm more like a 50, 52. <laughs> and I look back at old pictures and I'm like, ugh. Nothing at all in mind for the stack of them. I got make me an offer. Peter Bullwear, obviously not the most famous Ravens linebacker. I'm a Florida State fan. Really? He played for Florida State. Hurricane. He was, yeah, he was in... I'm a Hurricane fan. Oh, you're a Hurricane fan? <laughs> okay. So, you got the other, other, the other linebacker from the, from, from the U. Um, like 300 for the stack? Yeah. Bro, like I said, I'm not trying to... Yeah. I it's found them in the oh, garage, and my wife was like, you got to throw some stuff away. Yeah, I that's fair with you. Away. That's fair with me. These are nice pieces, for sure. I appreciate it. And what's the best way of payment? Whatever works for you. You have... um. Apple Pay or something like that? I have Venmo and Zelle. Okay, sweet. So, you, you still working this out? Uh, yeah. Okay. I just forgot this one, but... First time here? No, I was here a couple of weeks ago. He actually remembered me. I got oh, some breads for my daughter. Oh, for, nice. For, for her birthday. That's some uh, good condition stuff. How much? 300. Uh, I was at, uh, 550 for the five. Is that one for you? Oh, bro, listen, yeah. <laughs> listen, <laughs> listen. It's an 850 for everything. Right, yeah, okay, cool. yeah, that's fun. Listen. I, like I told him, my wife was like, if I got to get rid of stuff, you got to get rid of stuff. But the <laughs> thing is, I'm like, I may be able to make a couple yeah, dollars. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Goodwill, so it's up to you. People can buy sneakers, but at the end of the day, you can get something for it. I really like cool jerseys. Speaking of cool jerseys, this is one I got to tuck into the stash. The 2XL Fisherman Islanders joint. We have this on the rack. And yeah, I got to just tuck this in the stash. But let's just rifle through these jerseys real quick. Here we got the starter. Ricky Waters jersey right here. This is a nice one. We literally just got the Brian Dawkins in. The Brian Dawkins. I want to keep because I actually don't have a Dawkins authentic like that even though it's a little too small but this is a nice one to add to the collection as well speaking of collection Dan Marino teal starter keep the patch I mean this old starter stuff is just beautiful it's like a blessing that I have an establishment that people know if they find cool stuff like this in their garage they can stop by the store you know and get some cash for it this is a beautiful piece right here the big fundamental Tim Duncan I actually think I have this exact jersey but uh you know I'll definitely take another one this one's crazy Jordan you know about this guy not much just because like it just popped up on like my like Instagram or something with him and like um Ray Lewis there next to each other and they're talking about like the two great linebackers like they went to rival college something bull or something like that yeah. but crazy piece i kind of wish it was a ray lewis but hey either way this is definitely something different i'd assume this might be rarer than a ray lewis in all honesty like i said before to these guys geeking out look at the patch on that just the gold around the raven starter patch the off white on the side of it to the gold i mean this is just a beautiful piece next one this is a heater guys the number 18 vikings jersey who's that the freak randy moss is this a, the first year so what he was saying is that i didn't even know this he was saying that that's his dream number like 18 but at they the wouldn't let him use yeah at it. the time you couldn't use a team number you had to use something from 80 to 89 so he wore it only in the preseason and that's when he switched to 84 so when he went to the Raiders that's when he switched back to the 18 and he was saying that Keyshawn Johnson had 19 before him like before like he was in the league but the reason why he had 19 because 80 to 89 was filled up so they had to you know give him a wow. jersey wow that's interesting i didn't hear that story that's crazy i don't even think there's another one like this online number 18 authentic starter this is really good stuff the collector in me kind of like comes out when cool stuff like this comes in because i don't know i just have this like vision of just having this like museum in my head of just knowing i have all this really cool stuff on deck just in case like we want to showcase it or whatnot just because again stuff like this you might not ever find again and if you do few and far between speaking of that we got the wilson authentic sean alexander joint i love authentics that have this like what's it called called screen like not screen pressed but, exactly but just how you mix it up like it's not all stitch you know i used to hate that because i hate this stuff because obviously washing it is tough but as i've gotten older and start to find like really rare pieces in jerseys and stuff like that i feel like a lot of the rarer ones aren't always fully stitched because back in the day like the original jordans had this number they didn't have like the stitch number so it's refreshing to find cool stuff like that here and there and uh yeah so these are just some jerseys we found not really sure what we'll do with them for now i'll get them out the way we also got some cool shoes 
shoes. I'm not really gonna bore you guys too much with that. Some retros, some maroons, some aquas, all types of cool stuff. Shouts to him for stopping by. He definitely brought us some cool stuff. We definitely appreciate it. The low should be willing to do on the uh, th the top threes. Two thirty, two twenty. Yeah, I'm a little off. I'm around like one forty. I think they're sell around like two twenty five, maybe two fifty. Oh, the uh, shorts. I think shorts might hold off on just because Eric Emanuel for us is kind of tough to move, and the hype kind of has died down with Eric Emanuel. I think on your own you could easily get one thirty just for us. It's a little tougher. How about uh, store credit? Store credit, I bump it up. I say look around, see if you find anything. Those are. 340, bump this up to 160, to 180 on top. Would y'all take uh, University Blue 6, I um, mean, University Blue 1s, size 6 Y? Brand new? Yeah. You have them on you? Nah, you have the crib, but I can bring them. I would assume if we took them, probably like three. Yeah, like like three for them. Would you take 160 cash for these? And then I'll come back and buy these? I can meet you in the middle at 150. If you're gonna bring the, um, the ones, you just wanna do it all at once. It's just up to you, boy. You can do this now, too, if you want to. No, I'm gonna just bring them back, actually. All right, man. Top shelf. I'm calling from uh, South Texas, and uh, well, I was wondering, you know, I know y'all are buying stuff over here, like, you've been doing a lot of deals, and I would like, put you guys like, money for, like, like, little shoes, but it's, like, cheap. I don't know if y'all are cheap, and, you know? I mean, yeah, I th that sounds... Yeah, that sounds great. Um, lately, we've only been buying in store, but uh, you know, you, you can definitely DM us pictures of like what you have for sale. Just make sure to put kind of the prices you're looking for. That way, we can see if we'd be interested or not. All right, cool. Well, uh, to like, we're like on Instagram or something. Uh, yeah, Instagram would be good. Uh, that's Top Shelf Kicks, all one word. If you want to send it that way, or you can, um, if you find our Instagram, you could also email us directly as well. The email should be if you hit contact on the Instagram. Okay, okay. Sounds good, man. Appreciate it. Yeah, no problem, bro. Have a good one. Yeah, man. Y'all doing great out there, for real. Oh, we appreciate it, man. Thanks a lot for checking out the tell content. Your, tell, you, tell, your, tell your boss you guys got a little more money in South Texas, 956. Thank you, man. Shouts to 956. We really appreciate it. Yes, sir. All right. Have a good day, man. You too, bro. Peace. Shouts to 956. I'm gonna tell my boss that we appreciate it. Anyways, we're wrapping up here. Was it a busy day? Oh, what? Not the best, not the worst. It's actually super nice outside, which is crazy because I'm in sweatpants and a sweatshirt. Berwin looks like he's <laughs> about to go like somewhere in the winter as well. <laughs> it was like pretty cold this morning, I felt like, and now it's ridiculously nice outside, which is nice. What else is there to say? Crazy day today. Gotta think about going to Florida and let's wrap this thing up. Is it my shot? Nah, you forfeited shot yesterday. I forfeited my shot. Yesterday was your day. Tuesday was your day. <laughs> <laughs> I forfeited my shot. Darwin, is that? Darwin? I mean, I guess I'll let this slide, but I don't know whoever made this up. <laughs> I originated the one and done. I can't forfeit a shot. <laughs> what the hell? Actually, you can. If you originate, you can do whatever you want. You're right. <laughs> but I'll let this one slide. Go ahead, bro. You better make it. There's a lot of pressure now. You want to phone a friend? One and done. See y'all later. Doesn't that. sound too confident. Oh! oh! <laughs> what's up today is thursday we are here a couple orders nothing too crazy we got the top threes right here this one always goes for a lot of money honestly they're kind of hard to sell speaking of hard to sell we got these billy eilishes we got a bread toe low we got the black panda dunks which even though they restock they always seem to sell and then we got this really cool world cup 1994 apex one hat if you saw in the flea market episode where i sniped a bunch of these we still have a couple left so if you see this in the video and you want one hit us up we probably have some available we got some fly knit racers down there we got some air max 97s with the purple there and then we got these funny sandals that i'm wearing guys i was a huge fan of these i was like really excited to get them and wear them i had them for a minute to wear i don't know nike you should have said size up look at this guys this is this is this is what's going on this is like a <laughs> like a tempurpedic you could say insert but the problem is this is my true size and i keep stepping on this brown part so i'm pretty upset i was again excited to wear these i don't know man might have to switch over to the easy slide or something like that because these things are not the best idea shout out to everyone who checked out our episode yesterday it's doing pretty well we obviously appreciate the support all you guys watching tuning in liking dropping a comment whatever it is we definitely appreciate it i think i gotta send out money to the dude who won the last one so berwin do you know exactly how much that was or no i think it was 35 
35. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna call it 35. I think he Instagram messaged us. We're gonna get back to him on that. Send him the 35 bucks. Today's Thursday. Usually Thursday is like a pretty busy day leading into the weekend. So hopefully, you know, we do a lot of business today. I have a lot of content to work on myself, a lot of stuff in the works. So hopefully we can get a lot of stuff done today. Let's see what happens. I found them at the outlet. Really? Yeah, Jerry Gardens. Okay, so these three are new. No, those are tried on. Yeah, I was gonna say these yeah. are kind of like new. You said 650 for everything? Yeah. I guess we'll start here. Where, where are you at here? This is a stone sage? Yeah, stone sage. Where are you at? Uh, probably 160. These guys? Uh, 180. These? That's what they're going for, like 180? 160 here, 180 here. Yeah. Um, these? Probably like 80 bucks. And these? 220? 640? It comes up to 640. 640? I don't know if that works, but I could go back through. I like can't decide if these are gonna do really well in the future or yeah, like yeah. really bad because obviously like when they first came out with the low tops, they weren't going crazy, you know what I mean? And these are kind of like at that point, I feel like it's also weird because it's about to be hot outside, so obviously people don't want to wear high tops. And yeah. hot I also what? tried those on too, just letting you know. Yeah, word. How do they run? Uh, they run true size. Yeah, like. Uh, just true to side, you you recommend? Yeah. I think I would be like twenty dollars off. Six. If that, yeah, if that worked for you. Um. Yeah, I can do that. Yeah. That's cool with you. That's cool with you. I'm cool with that. Um. What is the best way of payment? Do you have? Uh, yeah. Let's do that. That's usually what you do, right? Yeah. And uh, I think I got some weight runners. I don't know if you guys take size fourteen. Hmm. Pray on. What were you looking for for this stuff? I don't know. I think these got a little separation on them. Yeah. These, I don't know if you guys take them in, but if you guys want to offer me something for them, just throw me whatever on those. These, I was probably like at 60 on them. Okay. Uh, These, probably the same. Okay. These, maybe like 120. These, I don't know, whatever you want to offer on those. And Wave Runners? Not sure. I want to see what you offer on those. Low 11s, maybe like... 120 maybe all right um and if you trade you say you didn't see you don't know what you want right no nah, not yet okay if for the um maybe these 120 as well okay 120 okay i didn't know yeah. there was one for it i didn't hear this one in my floor right. no nah, you good bro you shoot me an offer and i'll go from there <laughs> I, it off. I might just hold off the time yeah. <laughs> i never seen something like this before. 100 <laughs> i think that's fair i looked on on, on go i ain't seen no 14. Free on at least. I mean, what are you thinking? Because okay, we can sell these. I know they look like 100, 120. I think that's fair. I mean, I can I check. 100. I, think. I can check. I can check. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'll do I'll do whatever. Yeah. It's just, it's I know the inside. So yeah, I, I know. It's like, how do you let your shoes? Like, well, it wasn't even mine. I got those in like a big bulk deal. That's why. I just wonder, like, what was someone? And I didn't even like, notice that after. I was gonna hold off on these, honestly. I was gonna hold off on these just because they're just so the bottoms are so dull. Yeah. Um, I was gonna say 80 um, on these to make it a flat. Please the four. butters and you want to see eight and a half or nine, right? Okay. You want to do a 20? 420? <laughs> yeah, 420 um, <laughs> I would have kept these, they were in my size. They used to fit me tight as hell. I'm actually uh, 12 and up. Can you do 15? Fuck it, yeah. Alright, so that'll be four for you. Yeah, we have a bunch of stuff for sure. Store credit, I say just look around like like last time to find you. Anything. I got you, bro. Is he grabbing a toy too? No, 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 just a yeah, so um, we said three for those. Um, so yeah, uh, well yeah, I, I don't I wasn't sure what you were. Uh, it was four thirty five credit for the for his stuff. Okay. Should I owe you one ten and be three twenty five? Mm, yeah, that's cool. Yeah. My bad, bro. I no, you good, bro? Don't worry about all over the place. Um, Venmo, yeah, okay? Uh, yeah, Venmo. Yeah, if yeah, you want to bring yeah. up the Venmo real quick, and I'll scan it in. So, do you have stuff in mind, like for like you want to go per item or something? Per item, you can give me an offer in the whole lot, dude. It's I don't sell shoes. I sell shirts. This is good for you, by the way. Damn, really? Yeah, I paint like stuff I get at the bins that I can't do nothing with. I will paint them in them and sell them. Whoa. Put a better plan than that one. My, <laughs> my employees didn't take care of it. Damn, that's sick, man. And it's an Air Max 90, that's sweet. I think it might be your size. Might be 11. I fuck with your fit, by the way. I appreciate it. <laughs> I'm Joe. Oh, good Berlin, nice to meet you, bro. Joe, nice to Jordan. Meet you. Dude, they were really good move. Yeah. They were good at first, and then... Everything's down right now. This past two weeks, like... Yeah, everything just hasn't been moving. Like, I don't have the space for sneakers. Took I out every high-end t-shirt in my case and put it all, put, did all sneakers in there. And, like, not to mention, these are all, like, the same size. So one person comes in, it's like, oh, what do you got? Oh, all size 11. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, oh, if you're not in that size, then you're beat. <laughs> so it's everything's 11, you said, pretty much? Uh, there might be a few mixed in there, like, okay, 11. Yeah, if something's 10. Like, this is from a different buyout. Okay. Oh. Don't mind those tags, yo. Oh, no, nah, no, nah, either way, I, I admire, yeah. 
I just pulled those from the store, so. Where it's like a lot of this stuff I have is XL. You don't, you don't mind if I move this hat out the way? Oh yeah. Yeah. oh yeah, go for it. You like don't. This. My length cuts like 20 seconds. Like, I won't do anything shorter than 20. Like 19 for everything. All right, so we're not super far. Yeah, yeah. that doesn't sound too bad. We're not super far. <laughs> <laughs> not super far. Uh, like I, I went there like Can a few times back, back and they had the stuff on the website um, for super high. Me at uh, and then when I went there, 19? Like 40, 40. I'm like, yeah, I mean, that, I'm yeah, not too. Yeah, I'm not. Oh, yeah, it's you're at 19. I'm off for my fault. You're good. What are you doing? He was at 19, then said meet at 19. Uh, I, thought, yeah. I thought I said 18. <laughs> so I'm all over it. Nah, uh, two's cool. Two's right, cool. Cool. <laughs> cool. I just brought you see. random stuff that I thought you might like. I brought you wrestling because I yeah, know you wrestling, personally like wrestling stuff. Sure. But, like, yo, like, if there is anything you can do, don't hesitate to. I'm not high on this stuff at all. Nah, I got you, bro. I told him, don't worry about those price tags. They don't mean anything. Thing. I know Aaron needed a new Gardner Eagles jersey. <laughs> <laughs> you are a Birds fan, right? Yeah, hell yeah, yeah hell yeah, hell yeah. I'm about I to take all it. my Wentz, strip the back, put brown on yeah, the back. Yeah, it's so funny you said that. You know what I used to do? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's really. I you said that the, the prices don't mean much, but obviously they mean something. Yeah, so like, but like, I'm not here. Yeah. That's a good one. The back of this one, right? Well, the back of this one yeah. is amazing. And then I don't know if you peep the back of that. That's a. Uh, yeah, I like this one too. Do you like wrestling shirts um, sell well, well for you? Well like honestly, for us, like the high price ones. They were, they were, they were right five six months ago. So it's weird because like like I know I bought it. So expensive. you see this shirt right here? Yeah, I sold this for four fifty like three months. That's ago. That's insane. Wow. And now, um, it's, yeah, now they're listed for two hundred. That shoes was a little bit tough. Bro, but like, everything. I had, yeah, yeah, the, 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 the market dropped. No one wants yeah. Drop. Right. Stone Cold Rap Tee. Probably like yeah. two fifty four. Sold two of them over the summer for like yep. twelve to sixteen. Hundred. Yeah. Oh. And now I have yeah. one I'm sitting on and I can't get in for it. That's why this game is like you know as much as we like to hold shit. Miss, sometimes you have oh, to just really sell shit. I took a like huge loss. Like yeah. I stacked. I 300 wrestling tees for the past uh, five years because I collected them though. And I Bro, I have them. two bins over there. I'm sure you did. It's like, terrible, yeah. And then, then I did like, oh. pizza. He said he works at a pizzeria. <laughs> What? I swear to God. That's on you, bro. I'm <laughs> trying to eat better, you know what I mean? I'm hey, you want pizza? Of course you want pizza. I'll take some Free pizza. pizza. Oh, what y'all want? Pepperoni. Oh, yeah, throw that meat on the side. I gotta get exotic, bro. Pepperoni? Pepperoni. I'm good. Yeah, yeah, thinking, thinking of that. Pepperoni. Uh, <laughs> I can't <laughs> take it. <laughs> no you said we might want the Nike stuff? Yeah, the Nike stuff. Possibly, yeah. I actually brought that specific thinking like y'all might want the Nike stuff. Like, <laughs> I feel like we'd like it more than it actually. And I don't know, New York Mets. Alright, can we just... I'm just asking. Good. Five here? Yeah, I don't Yeah? Yeah, I don't care. Oh, I'm down for that. And then we'll do the 19 there. That's cool. And then... And then what? What? Talk to the black <laughs> okay. store, okay. man. Oh, you got a really cool store. Uh, Come check us out. Pastor President SJ. We're in uh, Barrington, New Jersey. Right outside of Philadelphia. I met him via eBay. Funny yeah. story. What I buy, I don't know if you remember. Thunder I was just telling them. Oh, what, you what, what did you buy? I don't remember. Oh, what you, oh you don't remember? Okay, no. it was a Thunder Dan, Suns Champion. Uh, replica jersey. I forget like what year it was, but at the time it's like everyone was like, trying to sell for like yeah. 180, 125. I think you had it up there for like 45 or something like that. I think I offered you like 30 or 35. You took it. I think you I might have a sticker. Yeah. Yep, I checked it out on Instagram and you opened a store, checked it out. It was a really cool store. Bought a lot of stuff that day. So. Do you remember when I ran into you with the flea and called you the wrong name? Yes, I, I do. Was <laughs> I was like, are you Alex? And you were like, it's Aaron, but and I was like, yeah. <laughs> small world, small <laughs> world. But, um, <laughs> Yeah, Look, I just knew it was AG13 on Instagram. And, like, <laughs> I probably saw, like, heard, overheard someone say something yeah. before, bro. I, I like, think I was really guy. pissed that day. I went home, I was sick. I was like, yo, this guy called me Alex. What the fuck? But, anyways, yeah, he has really good prices. So, check Always out his did. store. Always will. Yeah, South Jersey or on Instagram. Obviously, he ships. Yeah, so. All day. Yeah, man. I appreciate you taking the trip. I appreciate you. Yeah, Thank awesome, you man. Yeah. yeah, no, I understand. I mean, I can check. I just wanted to, like, just double check them. But, um, but, uh, you just look for cash today, right? Yeah. Right. Uh, I'll do 130 for all. You said 130 for all? Yeah. 140? That's cool. Uh, we have Venmo, PayPal, Apple Pay, right, we'll Zelle, Freak Zelle, if you need Zelle. Freak Zelle. That's cool. Alright. Uh, once you get some phone, he'll tell you. I got this. Brought this bag, you get 20 bucks. I'm just trying to get rid of all this shit. Right. You tell me a number on that. Yeah. Those are cool grades. Yeah, do that. Alright, yeah. Damn, the guy brought the pizza? That was you? Yeah. Damn, bro. bro. I feel better. I work at a pizza right now here and never bring you guys food. Which one? Master, Livingston. 
Master Pizza in Livingston. Is there one in Jersey City? No, it's not the same. Probably there probably is. Similar. Damn. There used to be one in, in Jersey City and Clifton. I don't know if the Jersey City one's still there. Damn, in Clifton. Pizza. That's far, man. But we, we appreciate it. Oh, for sure. I just felt bad. I was watching you guys this morning. I'm like, damn. How much you want for these? Earlier, I don't know. Really you tell really me, bro. You said what? Two fifty on these. Two fifty. Call that three. Paid everything. And I'll take a little Vegas? toy. From there. Oh, uh, these two. You said three for everything. Yeah, so fifty for these two. Two oh. fifty, fifty for these two. So three for everything. Oh yeah. That, yeah I'll take a toy. Yeah, go ahead, bro. Uh, Zell or Venmo, right? Oh uh, yeah. Well, um, Zell's working. It's a new month. We get that. These are These are marinas. You have one more. Uh, or you want to hold off for now? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna see how much. Uh, what do you want for Red Thunders? Uh, Two eighty. Two eighty. Uh, marinas. Uh, one eighty. Um, these, uh, I think 130. They got so many different versions of these. I don't, I don't mm -hmm. know which ones, but they got like female versions and yeah. male versions. Yeah, I think this the middle, might be the. Oh, no, I'm not too sure. All right. yeah, there's another one with their um, red, red, uh, red, the red tag. Yeah. This one is tricky. Just high dunks in general hasn't yeah, just been yeah. moving for us. Um, you feel like the dunks are kind of dying though, right? Oh, they're dead. Yeah, the dunks and ones are dead. Yeah, um, no, this, that, every time I get out of Yeah, to me, this, I, I personally feel like this like. No money to be made unless yeah, you get like a crazy. It's like a collab or some shit. Exactly. Right. These I might hold off on. These two is valid, but um, for the marinas, I was at one seventy. Oh, so on retail. Yeah. So the two eighty uh, was um, valid. What's the price difference? Um, brand new and used. Uh, let me check for brand new. I oh, know you got you got a pair of these. Right? Yeah, I had those. Yeah. And the eleven and a half is five fifty. Um, the eleven is five. Eleven is five. Yeah. Uh, so that's the lowest you can do. Uh, for which one? The uh, used. Uh, talk to me. Tell me what you're thinking. All right, so let's do this. All right, um, let me put these two towards um the used pair. Okay. And um, I just pay the difference. All right, so wait. Let me get you yeah. the other one. Can you first. do um? Can you do 40 though? For those used. Oh uh, yeah, check them out first. Yeah, yeah, yeah let me see. First. What's the best you can do on a new pair? I got you right now. Well, I told you 550. Yeah. Want to add 60? Really? Yeah. Uh, it's a pretty cool shoe. Let's see. All right, let's do it. Let's All right. Uh, and yeah. then this is clean as that. Well. DS pair? Yeah, DS. Sheesh. Yeah, I can't fit up. My, my, my true size is 11. You want 11, 11 and a half? And half yeah. Come on, bro. Damn, that's what's up. Yeah, it's a good choice. So. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, I know. I saw you with them all. I'm like, damn, this is good. <laughs> <laughs> you were sleeping on these. Like, don't get yeah, me wrong. Yeah. White's hard. No, I, I, I ain't going to lie. Blue my favorite color. Yeah. But yeah. I, personally, yeah. I'm not even being biased. Yeah. It just looks like better to me. I said, I said the same yeah, thing. I said the same thing. It was just like, you freak them the right way. You yeah. look like the pink laces yeah. in them. Yeah. You can throw some white laces yeah. in them, too. Give them a little pop. All right, it's 4:53. Got some stuff going out. Not a lot of action going on today. Like yes and no. Early today, when we opened up, it was a little hectic, a little busy and stuff like that. We had multiple transactions and deals and stuff going down. Shout out to Pastor President. He came by early today, sold us some good stuff. Just before we run down that stuff, just show you guys a couple of teas that you know he bought. I feel like you guys will appreciate. A lot of guys been calling, asking about wrestling shirts and stuff like that. We bought like about seven, about seven teas. So we got this. NWO shirt in the back says bad has arrived and it's here to stay. Got this stone cold 100% pure. We'll pass T, part of my language to all you kids out there. No back hit. We got this Raw's Jericho shirt right here. I think this one has a back. Yeah, it says, and you will never ever be the same again. So that one's pretty cool. Good sizes too. This is 2X. This is 2X. This one doesn't have a size, but this one's like a um like a larger XL. This one also doesn't have a size, but this one runs like a large. This Kevin Nash NWO shirt, the big sexy, no hit on the back. Probably my favorite favorite one that we bought yeah that one's pretty sick this is an xl rattler stone cold on the back you see the that face wild. that green hit just just really pops it goes crazy we got another stone cold right here this is royal rumble no chance in hell this is royal rumble no chance in hell this is i believe january 24th 1999 so that's pretty fire and then wwf world wrestling federation wrestlemania the raging climax and then boom you got the undertaker you got the rock you got stone cold um <laughs> Triple H. I, I, I don't know. I don't know much about him, but there's like there's a few people I know. Oh, what's his name? I forgot his name. Mankind. Mankind. Yes, and Kane. And I don't know who that is either. <laughs> 
little m ms in the background. <laughs> <laughs> Double XL. So for you guys who's been asking for like some double XLs and XLs, we have a few here. Hopefully, by the time you guys see this video, these shirts are still here. I already flipped all them up, so they're going to be on the eBay soon. So probably by this weekend. By the time you see this video last weekend, check out the eBay. Constantly check out the eBay because we always put new stuff every day. And by the time you guys see the video, it's always like a week after. So we're going to get a jump on stuff early. Just check the eBay every day. So let's go over here to some of the stuff that's so during the day. Within like the last hour, right here, we have old classic black and white dunk. You guys seen the last video. You seen the dude basically like begging for a better price. Again, this shoe does really, really well. This is a 10 and a half. So the used 10 and a half last time. So this shoe does really well, even with the 50 million restocks. He moved this shoe easily in here. So these are the Vandal Highs, the Area 72s. These are disgusting. Those are crazy, but I I'm with you on that. I feel like the details on the shoe is cool, but overall the shoe is just ugly. It's just, it's just an ugly sneaker. Probably my favorite sale. You got some citrons. Got it for a really good price. Sold it for a really good price. Man, shout out to um, Ty and Cali for more hats again and some kicks. He's the latest heat hunter. And we got the St. Louis Devil Rays, Diamondback, Kiss, and then this Minor Leaks hat. French Blues and some Indigo 12s. Put some stickers in there for him. Shout out to you, Ty. We're gonna get this stuff packed up and hopefully get out today. We should get out today, honestly. So catch you guys in a second. Uh, this is the, yeah, the, um, the Oreo, Oreo, right? Yep. All right, man. What are you looking for for everything? Like aside from the the um, the UNLVs. 14. 14? Yeah. All right. I mean, cool. I, mean, I might be out, but it's just, this one I couldn't find the top. I don't know where I put this on top of this. All right, cool. There's this DS though. So. Um, I can give you 1240 and the UNLVs. Can you fly the 13? Uh, use that 14. I came up to 15, and I dropped the Oreos. Oh, not the Oreos. The um. UNLVs. Yeah, I, yeah I have a hard time saying it too sometimes. I dropped them to uh, like 260, 270, I think, on yeah, those. That's fine, yeah. PayPal, right? Yeah, if you can, please. Yeah. Mellow, where you at? More on payout for everything. I think it was at 170, 150. Okay. On these, where you at? Um, I was at 150 for these, or if not, I'll just take retail, I think 140. Um, dunks? KCTC, um, at 160. 70 for the slides, uh, 70 for the 2.5, and 190 for the, uh, the women's. Okay. These three are definitely big. Alright. This one I hold off on, they're just so low. 2.5? Yeah, 2.5 is just super low. Alright. I might just hold off on too. Like they're kind of cool, but this type of shoe we have trouble with. You could do the 80 on the slides, and you could do these for 60. I'll give you. And can you do these for like 130? I paid 125 for them. If I do 80 here, yeah. you do 60 there, and 125 here. 130. 130. Okay. Let's say if I pass on these two, what would be the best to do here? You use that 160. I'm really trying to get rid of all of this. That's why I, even the smaller these, the baby shoes, I can give them to you for under retail even. Or the slides, I can even do like 60 or some shit. Okay. And then I'll stay at 130 on here. So 60, 60, 130. I'll run that. I'll run the, the 130, 60, 60. I ran 190 here. I came to retail here. I ran the 150 here. So that should be 730. I'll run it back. 150 on the Mellows. 140 on the uh, 2002s. 190 there. 130 here. 120 together. 730. This is 730. Uh, Zell? Yeah, Zell. So. 630 closing down it's supposed to rain these next three days right three days burn mm -hmm. Wednesday weekend get your mom a gift something nice some kicks what you get your mom bro mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you know well, you did this last year <laughs> <laughs> something nice if I'm not mistaken I'm pretty sure you did it last year. <laughs> you was like I'm gonna wait till Saturday <laughs> Look at this one and done real fast. Get the union oh, right. oh, right. oh, right. <laughs> Don't let me tell the people you about to trade. <laughs> 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 so close. 